Come on, Emrakul. We want to get that the serialized Emrakul. Can we do it? Maybe. Let's see what happens. Uh, let's see what we get here today. We have a Malevolent Rumble. Is it? One a green. Return a real top four cards of your library. Uh, you may put a permanent card from among them into, into your hand and put the rest in a graveyard. Uh, create a zero one Eldrazi or colorless Eldrazi spawn creature token with sacrifice add uh, colorless. We have an airy auxiliary. Uh, it's a three one uh, three and a white for a three three so bird soldier. Uh, enter the battlefield uh, support two. That's flying. Uh, Conduit goblin. Sure. Enter the battlefield. You get two energy. Beginning of combat on your turn. You may pay one energy if you do. Uh, another target creature you control gets plus one plus one and gains haste until end of turn. Unfathomable truths. Four and a blue for an instant. Devoid and uh, draw three cards and create a zero one Eldrazi spawn creature tokens with sacrifice this creature add colorless. Piratic rebirth. Uh, two black red for an instant. Return target artifact or creature card from your graveyard to your hand. It deals damage equal to that card's mana value to up to one target creature or planeswalker. We have a propagator drone. All right, uh, one and a green, and then uh, two two Eldrazi drone, uh, the void creature tokens you control have evolved, and then three and a green, uh, create a zero one Eldrazi spawn token that sacks for mana. Drowner of Truth, five hybrid green blue, green blue Eldrazi seven six with the void. When you cast a spell, colorless was spent to cast it, create a create two colorless Eldrazi spawn creature tokens, uh, sacrifice add uh, colorless. Swamp, that's neat. Strike it rich, it's meh. Charitable Levy, this one is neat. Uh, one and a white for an enchantment. Non-creature spells cost one more to cast. Whenever a player casts a non-creature spell, put a collector collection counter on it. Then if there are three or more collection counters on it, sacrifice it if you do draw a card, then you message your library for a planes card, put it on a battlefield tapped and shuffle. We have a crab abomination. Wow, wow, okay, all right. Four black black for a 5-5 five, five crab demon because that's a thing apparently emerge from artifact five black black wow when crab abomination enters the battlefield target opponent exiles the top card of their library a card from at random from their graveyard and a card at random from their hand you may cast a spell from among the exile cards without paying its mana cost while well, you're paying six for the crab demon that does basically almost nothing so you better get something for free all right, selective obliteration. Uh, three colorless colorless for a sorcery. Each player chooses a color, then exile each permanent unless it's colorless or only the color its controller chose. All right. Blue to Delta, extended or borderless or whatever, extended art, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, fetch for our land. Uh, Spy Master's Vault, uh, it's a land. Whenever it enters the battlefield, or enters the battlefield, tap unless you control a swamp. All right. Then it adds swamp, and then black and tap target creature you control gains X, or conv connives X, where X is the number of creatures that died this turn. Woo! Wow! We got a retro foil Ragavan. That's neat. That's neat. I don't know what. That's pretty cool. Look at the. These are the poles from this one. Yeah, pretty neat. The Ragavan's sick. Wow. Oil Retro Ragavan. That's pretty cool. All right, that's it. See ya.